Every 15 minutes is a program to bring awareness about the issues of drinking and driving. Center High School held the Every 15 Minutes program during March 1st and March 2nd. We interviewed several participants right after the funeral to find out how they felt about their experience. This was a wonderful experience for me because it really gave me a different perception on life and what it really means to us. It just gives, it gives me another reason to, to live life to the fullest, so don't make any regrets. The most important thing to me was probably the look on everyone's face when at the crash scene and during the funeral, everyone's crying their faces off and it just, you don't like seeing the people you love cry and so it's difficult. Uh, I got to learn a lot. I got to hang out with all my friends and people I didn't know. I also got to experience what it goes through as a drunk driver or being killed as a drunk driver. Uh, it was a good experience for me. It made me realize what's more important in life than um, anything else. And what's important to me is that my life is what makes a difference and I can change things. I think that this experience shows um, realistically what would happen if one of these 32 students were to disappear. The impact on the student body and on their families and loved ones um, it vividly shows that when you have people stand and you can see just how many people are touched by just a few. It shows how your friends feel and how your family feels. It's just it's really crazy and intense and so real. It's a good experience because it affects all my friends, my family, and me in it. And it's just, it was really touching and all that. And it shows you what really, really can happen if you do make that mistake or do not make that mistake, but it's just really touching. I will never drink and drive, really won't, you know. How stop my friends from drinking and driving. If you do drink, just stay at the house. If you get kicked out, just don't stay in your car, don't drive, that's all. This is a great experience because it uh, really gives me a taste of what my family and my friends would go through if I were gone and I realize how precious life is and how important it is to treasure the ones you love. The reason that it was so great was probably because it was one of the worst, day, worst days of my life where I had to see all of my friends and family crying and I had to listen to everyone's personal stories during the retreat and we had to write our goodbye letters to our parents. It was just completely horrible. Worst, worst day of my life, but that was basically everyone's wake-up call. That was my wake-up call, and I know how many people I'm going to impact if I ever do something like that, and I I know like that, that's never going to happen. I'm never going to let that happen to me. I'm never going to try and never let that happen to anyone else. As far as the overall uh, program itself, I have I have uh, two older sons, 27, 28, and a daughter, 13. So just thinking, you know, forecasting, you know, what transpired here to them was pretty powerful for me. You know, a lot of times by us having that we respond out to these calls, we don't get the emotional connection that the families that the families do. And so for me, being involved in this program, you know, at the level that I was, and then seeing the information today in the presentation was pretty powerful for me. This experience was great because I got to see from all angles how many people this really does affect and what a great opportunity this program is. And I got close with people that I never thought I would get close with, which is really what it's about, is you know this whole student body uniting against drunk driving. The candlelight little thing that we did at the retreat where everybody passed around a candle and got to speak individually about something in the a story they had to tell and that, that was special because everybody shared a little bit of themselves and we got really close. You no know, honestly like I feel like this was it was way more than a good experience like I understand it was an act but the fact of my close friends and thinking about my family uh, it was it was really bad. Um, every everything was so close, like emotional. It impacted everyone like so fast. Like all the guys were from the beginning were just like, you know what? 
Well, no one's gonna, no one's gonna cry. We're fine. We're fine. Then the girls started crying, and then we even saw teachers crying, and we we're just like, whew, this is starting to get real. And then, honestly, like I feel like this was a, an amazing experience, and like I'm thankful to everyone, to everyone that let me be in this. One thing that was like down in my mind was uh, my relationship with my dad. Uh, honestly, I don't know what I like if he was to die or if, um, if I was to die in the crash. I don't know what I would like what would happen like with my family and stuff. That was like the one thing I like throughout the whole experience that just wouldn't come out of my mind. Um, this was a good experience because um, it teaches you a lot of things like not to drink and drive and like it was really emotional because all the speakers went there and they talked about how one of their daughters died and then another girl lost her father and it's really emotional and makes you really think twice about the decisions you want to make. People take it as a joke but once you get into it it's really serious and like it's really sad so everybody should think twice about what they what their decision is next time. The only thing I can say is don't drink and drive. It's bad. Oh gosh. I think my whole outlook on life changed. I mean, going through this program is just like the most emotionally draining experience, but best experience I think I've ever had. And I will never, ever get in a car with somebody who's drunk or drive drunk ever again in my life. That's a promise. Just don't be afraid to call somebody, you know? There's, like a lot of the speakers said, there's no worse feeling than having somebody, you know, get that call and your child or friend or brother or sister has been gone. Just call somebody. It's not worth it. It was devastating. Absolutely devastating. I mean, you, your heart just sinks and um, reality is just, it's numbing. It really opened up my eyes and it showed me that there's a lot more to life than we realize. And to imagine it being gone with such a poor decision, it really changed me. And I think it changed everyone <laughs> because we realized how much everyone means to us and how much we mean to others. And I just want everyone to know that you're all loved. We learned about life in general and a lot about the consequences of drinking and driving. The every 15 minute program will start to make everyone think twice before they drink and drive.